Let's take you to five things you need to know for your Friday. Flint City Council voting to begin the process of appointing a parliamentarian, which will sort through agenda topics and keep council in order. That's after several meetings of personal disputes. The vote passed seven yes, one no, and one abstention. Flint Mayor Sheldon Neely announcing an agreement with local 1600 city workers. Neely says that they will get a $2 an hour raise and another raise in July. He says it's the largest increase for union members in more than 30 years. The city now has contracts in place with all six of its collective bargaining units. Gus Macker basketball tournament is coming back to Midland this weekend. But starting today, August 11th at 11 a.m., Main Street from Rod to Townsend, Townsend to State, Larkin Street from McDonald to Townsend, State Street from Maine to Ellsworth, all closed. And this will be through Monday at about 6 p.m. Saginaw African Cultural Festival begins. Organizers say its purpose is to celebrate the collective building and developing of the community. There are plenty of activities for the whole family to celebrate the culture. It's on the former Morley School grounds on the Pier Avenue. All right, check this out. The Perseid meteor shower hits its peak this weekend when the crescent moon will be illuminated ever so slightly. Delta College Planetarium has a meteor shower observation tonight at 9 p.m at Port Austin's Port Crescent State Park, which you'll be able to watch through binoculars and telescopes. So the meteor shower ends September 1st, the meteorological start of the fall season. Exciting. What well, music's most popular?